بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم عن جابر رضي الله تعالى عنه قال قال رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم يبعث كل عبد على ما مات عليه رواه مسلم جابر من عبد الله رضي الله تعالى عنه وجابر he said that the Messenger of Allah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said that the slave will be resurrected upon the deeds that he died upon. And this is collected in Muslim. For us, as believers in Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala, that is something we have to reflect upon. To strive our best to be on righteousness all the time because we don't know when we'll be taken and I advise myself first and foremost with this as it's easy to become complacent with regards to the deeds and the actions that we do thinking that we have more time in this dunya thinking that we have time for toba thinking that we have time to do greater ibadah to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So we postpone it now, thinking, oh, when I get so-and-so to such-and-such such age or such-and-such such place, I'll begin to pray witr regularly in my life. Or I will fast on Mondays and Thursdays. But none of us are guaranteed another day, another minute. And that's why the time for ibadah, the time for tawbah al Allah, is now. So rush to repentance to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. As the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said that he repented more than a hundred times a day, alayhi salatu wa salam. So how much more are we in need of tawbah and having a righteous ending? And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless us with ilm nafi, ruskan tayyib, wa amal mutakabbilan and give us tawfiq and tawbah and coming back to him subhanahu wa ta'ala wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyya muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam